pressures and their applications. Pressure is defined as the perpendicular or normal force per unit, area acting on a surface. The SI unit of pressure is Newton per square meter or Pascal. For better understanding, a woman wearing high-heeled shoes sinks deeper into soft ground, than a female student wearing flat school shoes. Both the woman and the student have the same body weight, acting downwards on the ground. The woman's weight is spread over a smaller area of her shoes, thus, exerting a higher pressure on the ground. The student's weight is spread over a larger area of her shoes, thus, exerting a lower pressure on the ground. High and low pressures have been used in different situations. The magnitude of pressure exerted on the surface, can be increased or decreased by adjusting the magnitude of force applied. Force also can be adjusted, by increasing or decreasing the surface area of contact. Applications of high pressure. A sharp knife can be used to cut an object easily. This is because a small force applied on a very small area, of the knife edge can produce a large pressure for cutting the object. Saws, chisels and planes have sharp edges to produce a large pressure for cutting. Nails, pins, and needles, also have sharp points to produce a large pressure, for piercing an object easily. Spiked running shoes can provide a better grip for athletes running on a track, because these shoes have spikes that produce large pressure to pierce the track. Ice skates are designed to have a small area of contact, between the skates and the ice. While skating, the weight of the skater produces a large pressure on the ice and melts it, thus, enabling the skates to slide easily over a thin film of water. Applications of Low Pressure Bulldozers are usually moved by a chain, with sharp edges in between surfaces of large area, to decrease the pressure exerted on the ground. In this way, the chain can prevent the bulldozers from sinking into soft ground. Heavy lorry and buses are usually fitted, with more than four wheels of larger surface area to decrease pressure exerted on the road. This can prevent the tires from bursting and sinking into soft ground. Skis are designed to have a larger surface area to decrease the pressure exerted on the snow. This enables the skiers to move smoothly without sinking into snow. Tall buildings are usually built on a base of large surface area, to decrease the pressure and to prevent the buildings from sinking into the ground. Thank you for taking time to watch this.